All right, good morning, and welcome back to another episode of Rogue Tech. So, here we are continuing with the item acquisition. Again, I think the only thing we're going to build, if we build anything... Ah, missions reset because of the financial report. Okay. So we have a couple more really high school recoveries. Got that blackout there. So with the blackout, I will be limited to four mechs, I think. Let's do it. Why not? Uh, five, or six mechs. Okay. So. What do we bring? We have, we have a lot of good mechs to bring. Uh, definitely bringing the motor scooter so we can test out the uh, Hyper Assault 40. Uh, Clist is good if there's a vehicle. If not, then it's still... Cataclysm is still a good mech for just raw damage, but... Specifically really good if they bring any vehicles. Um, I think I'm going to drop Glitter Dust for Holy Heck. And yeah, yeah, we could have easily... We could have easily dropped on this mission while Holy Heck was still repairing. Whoops. But it's fine. So... Oh, and we have to be under 400 tons. Oh. Oh dear. Oh dear. Um... Okay, so we have to be under 400 tons. So... Ek, back out. Uh... Glam back in. So we need to drop 120 tons. I guess we'll... Oh man, we would need to drop... Okay. So if we drop... Pitcher... And then we replace Warhorse with our Catapult. And where's Time Lord? Is that enough? I don't... I don't feel like that's enough. But let's try anyway. Alright, so here's a good precursor mission for our next playthrough. We'll be doing about something like this every time. And there is a support lance as well, so... Do battle with the support lance, which appears to be down there. And then we move up to that point. Okay. But we are out of combat right now, so... Coordinates received. Affirmative. Just kinda... Confirmed. Trying to get in position, I guess. You're asking a lot of an old guy. About wow, five evasion on the Atlas on, on motor scooter. That's... Wow. <laughs> Grandpa is nice and protected in his little virtual reality pod. Alright, so waiting on you, Commander. Still not in combat. Don't need to tell me twice. Okay, there's a Marauder 2C, Warhammer 2C, Warhammer 2C, and a Stormwolf. Alright. Position confirmed. Moving out. You're asking a lot of an old guy. Moving out. Alright, let's see how quickly we can melt through these guys. I'm on the bright side of the blackout, it is one lance at a time, so... Good to go. This won't be as challenging as if we were doing, like, a battle or... something of the sort. Right there, I can get direct line of sight. But it will not tell me my hit chances. Alright! Move order received. And they're actually pretty good. 
All right. Firing. Opening salvo. Pretty good damage there. I hear ya. Oh, and there's a warhammer on our back. Okay. Noted. And just shooting all the things. And was that a hyper assault Warhammer 2C? I mean, he's on the ground now, so he's not going to get another turn, but. I believe that said hyper assault gossip there. Yeah, hyper assault 30. Good to go. Glad he's not getting another turn. All right. Commencing alpha you. strike. He's gone. All right. Next. Gotcha. Next. Warhammer coming into our back. Oh, God, I was sleeping. Does not what have direct line of sight yet. I think we're gonna roll right up. Oh, I don't here. like going fast. It's scary. And yeah. So I think the hyper assault has higher crit chance and better clustering than the streaks. So I don't really know where to put it, but we'll we'll try that. Try that. That's a pretty good chunk of damage. On my way. All right, and fire. Target's taking a critical hit. I do need to be cautious. Okay, some medium-improved heavies and ATMs. All right. I do have to be cautious leaving this guy on my back, but, uh... Eh. Hopefully he won't be able to one-tap any of us. What's up, boss? Acknowledged. Stormwolf. Oh, those are actually SRMs, not ATMs. Okay. Actually, you know what? Let's just let's go ahead and put Warlord on cooldown. Pew. Yeah, that's like everything hitting. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful. Ow. Okay. Okay, that was. What can All I right. do for you? Fair enough. Got it. I think I'm more worried about that than I am about the storm wolf. Those hyper assaults are dangerous. Engine destroyed. Okay. Oh God, I was sleeping. What do you want? And let's see if we can just finish him off real quick and easy. Okay, so the Hyper Assault 40 uses four shots per uh, per shot. Four, uh, four ammo per shot. Noted. We need a lot more ammo then. <laughs> yeah, I thought that I thought that I would need more ammo. That's fine. That's completely fine. Kind of tucking her around this ridge, so she hopefully doesn't get shot in the back by the um, what is it, Marauder? Marauder at our backs? Warhammer. Let's do this. All right. Moving out. Spin the TARDIS around. Huge. Alright, Marauder 2C. Going on a nice little trip.
Sure. You know, the fact that we're seeing vehicles less and less frequently makes me feel like I should swap out one of the bins of uh, armor-piercing goss ammo for just regular goss ammo. Order. All right. On it. Targeting for an alpha strike. Warhammer oh, soaking God, quite, uh, quite a bit of fire there. Want? Oh, I don't like going fast. It's scary. This is bad. <laughs> Since we have two shots left of the Hyper Assault 40, we basically have a 100 ton mech that's wasting, that doesn't have 16 tons of assault. Him up, him down, just like that's, woods. that's not great. Our only hope, really, is that the uh, the enemies coming at us little by little saves us. Roger that. All right, and drop back to Artemis. Giving them everything I've got. Okay. Keep that down. Cool. Commander. Got it. Affirmative. And that should be a knockdown, if not a destruction. And down he goes. Down he goes. Waiting on you, Commander. All right. Affirmative. Sure. This should be good. Marauder 2C milling back and forth. Standing by. I don't know what he thinks he's doing, but he's not gonna accomplish much doing that. Sure. Firing all weapons. Okay. Now we're just yeah. down to, Good to go. the last guy. Ah, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Yes, boss. Um. Yeah, I think I'm going to. On the move. Wait, can I fire indirectly? Like... No, I can't. I didn't twist enough. Whoops. Commander. Uh. Yes, Commander. You know what? I'll Understood. just Moving start back. advancing. Ah, get back God, into I was a sleeping. nice little group. What do you want? Waiting for orders. Going turbo. He's gonna have to crest the hill eventually. Commander. Or he'll just keep dancing back and forth and doing nothing. That's, right, that's Commander. fine too. Waiting for orders. I mean. Good to go. Okay. I guess I should have started the engagement uh, with the with the TARDIS. Yeah, he uh, he actually has some pretty scary uh, firepower there. Hmm. Twenty percent hit chance for double damage. Roll the dice, and it hit. Good. Oh okay. God, I was sleeping. What do you Grandpa want? Did not quite make it. Yeah. 
Waiting for orders. Affirmative. Hope I didn't overswing it there. Good. Okay, so this should be his last attack. Good Doing nothing. Go. Okay. Double time. Yes, Commander. Um. Okay. Acknowledge. Fair enough. You wanna you wanna hide over there? That's fine by me. I have three shots of type, and I'll save that for the actual fight. Look at that. Look at that. Look. I hear ya. Standing by. Ready for orders. Move order received. Okay. You know, I probably should have gone offensive push, push him back in initiative, let everyone go before he goes. But, eh. It's fine. So, that, like, 70 Recording. damage that I just took what can was I do for ya? just me being bad. That's all Printing. it was. Fire! How's it going? So, this shouldn't take much longer. Ah, oh God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Okay. Wow, he felt good to go. Now, time to activate the first point. Good to go. Uh huh. Not with the TARDIS. Consider me there. On my way. Oh, yeah, I should turn off uh, the enhanced of imaging guy. before it explodes on me. Got it. Waiting on you, Commander. On my way. Coordinates received. That's the machine off. Grandpa. This is so good. <laughs> sprint for sprint for four or move for four. So good. Coordinate All right, moved. let's find out what we're up against. Oh, I was Waiting off by one order. turn. Whoops. Commander. Moving to position. Um. Okay, we got a hot drop, but we do have friendly turrets, so that's good. That's an arrow four turret. Friendly fire incoming. Long Tom. Oh, jeez. Arrow four turret. We're gonna take more. <laughs> oh my god. All of our friendly turrets are going to just destroy us. All of them. That is. That is most unfortunate. I read you, Commander. Moving out. On it. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, that's a black rose. Okay. Noted. Alright, turn 23. The dragon that is like right there in our backs. Ow. Okay, turret mount destroyed. Luckily, it's built in. But, uh, yeah. 
Wow. Oh, God. Uh, they're shooting me and I'm really scared. For real this time. So what do you have in your arms? Your medium lasers? Just your medium lasers? So I'd gain 100 damage of punch in exchange for 30 damage twice. Yeah, let's do it. You're asking a lot of an old guy. You think I'm stuck in melee with you? No, you're stuck in melee with me. Okay. Dragon down. Wow, he fell down like I do. Okay. Commander? Litter dust. Right arm not looking great. Black Rose. On my way. Got it. Okay. That's a critical hit. Receiving you. Location. And confirmed. hopefully this is a kill. Not a kill. Oh dear. Man, they really like their hyper assaults. I hear ya. I mean. It's risky, but do I have a choice? Got it. No stray shots, good. And stay down. I really feel like I didn't have a choice there. Okay, Atlas firing indirectly. Love to see it. Love to see it. Waiting for orders. And then there's the Mad Cat Mark II over here that still hasn't done anything. But I really want that Warhammer 2C down if possible. I don't like Hyper Assaults. Crits are scary. Okay. So here goes our allies firing massive splash AoE everywhere. But luckily, none of our people are too close to any of the enemies. Alright, we should be fine. We should be fine at this point. Double time. Let's go. Fire. Firing. Yeah, they're like all unsteady from our friendly turrets. Ah, oh God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Although he's actually completely fresh. Hyper like assault, crit, not destroyed. But that is a knockdown, so. Okay. Good to go. Hmm, decisions, decisions. Moving fast. And I'm like completely disengaging from the. Where's the Hyper Assault? Hyper Assault 30 Clan, right there. I want that gone. Firing everything I've got. Okay, so he's dead. Good. Even better. Destroyed. But yeah, if I can keep my distance from the Atlas, he'll fire indirectly. 
and then the turrets will hit him. And he will not be a happy camper. What can I do for you? Go for a field goal between my units. Sure. Let's uh let's see what happens. No through armor damage, apparently. I see. I see. Ow. Ow. Okay. Quit it. My mech is overheating. Alright, TARDIS needs to fall back slightly. Just because of minimum range considerations. Cannot actually get out of minimum range. Okay. Double time, let's go! Sure. Oops, I accidentally acided my uh, atlas as well. Oh god, yeah, they're shooting <laughs> me and I'm Whoops. really scared. For real this time. Did none of my turrets do anything? Really? On the move. Yeah, I I love a vulture. <laughs> Still cooling. Alright, so the Mad Cat should not get another chance to do anything. Atlas still firing indirectly. Leave pistol alone. Jeez. Waiting for orders. I guess no Cataclysm dude. will start pounding this dude. Firing everything I've got. Yeah, I think I think I'm going to oh, God, I was swap out one want? bin of it, uh, armor piercing ammo for a bin of regular. We're gonna go for a kick. Do I even need enhanced imaging on? No, no, I do not. You're asking a lot of an old guy. And boom. You think I'm stuck in melee with you? No, you're stuck in melee with me. I broke him like. Waiting for orders. Glitter dust. Really, can't uh, can't get direct line of sight. Aha, can. Just has to barely move here. All right. Kill. Please. Thank you. All right. Enemy down. So all that's left is the last little atlas. Full speed, no target. And I'm going to go with LK to try to get the knockdown. And got it. Commander? And I cannot get line of sight anywhere. All right. Yes, Commander. Pistol, how about you? No? No? Okay. How about Grandpa? Ah, oh, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? No, no, not Grandpa either. Anyone? Waiting on you, Commander. I mean, Clist, yeah. Okay. You betcha. All weapons are go! Alright. So I'm assuming the head was hit with one of the missiles or lasers, yeah. Commander. Not with the armor piercing shot. Knocked 
I am out of long range. Good to go. I mean, I guess I'll reserve and wait Standing until by. he potentially does something. Ah, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Wow, he is he is really really far down there, isn't he? Acknowledged. Okay. Ah, God, so who I'm now sleeping. has lame sight? What do you want? Uh, not oh, Grandpa. I, like going fast. It's scary. I should really turn his enhanced imaging off. Waiting for orders. Double time. Okay. Orders. I just realized those arrow turrets and everything are going to continue firing as we get to the next phase of the mission. Oh, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Oh, I That's don't gonna like be going fast. It's scary. Running him up, knocking him down just like Bellow Woods. No more missiles, bro. Good to go. Oh, that's a UAC-20. Well then. Yes, Commander. On my way. You know what? It's fine. Because he should die. I did not... I did not realize the LRM-20s were just... Were just... <laughs> that should have been a kill. That absolutely should have been a kill. Going full speed. But it's fine. No harm, no foul. Locking in always. Okay. Hostile. Okay. All right. On to the next phase. You're asking so, a lot of an old guy. This has been a lot easier than I expected. Got it. Move auto received. But I do generally find blackouts pretty easy. Right, Commander. Blackouts and escorts, where they're just dropping like what one lance at a time. It really does take a lot of the uh, a lot of the chaos out of the equation. Coordinates received. And it's an ambush. <laughs> oh, of course it's an ambush. Clist, time to shine. Time to shine. Affirmative. That is like all vehicles, isn't it? Ooh, no. Ow. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Ow. Okay. I hear ya. Okay, so we have the Seth Stealth Bomber that just went. Guaranteed hit chance. Seth that hasn't gone yet. Uh, we are going to step right over here. Just like so. We are going to multi target this one. They're stealth. No. Aw, oh, they're stealth. I can't multi target. Curses. Alright, well, you know what? That's fine. Here we go. 
AMS. Okay. Ready for orders. Uh yeah, actually you kinda need to then again your front armor looks fine, it's just your back armor that's bad, so. Spin you off to a flank. Acknowledged. Alright. Opened up the Warhawk. Pascatel. Ow. What? Oh, sorry, Commander. I'm what hit. was that? What did he just hit me with? We're down up next, Commander. Neural feedback. Pilot incapacitated. Left arm destroyed. Left torso destroyed. Oof. I hope Pistol's alive. Dude, what are these guys bringing? We lost a mech. Uh, so I know I just got done saying. Oh, God, oh it's just one lance at a time. Mind? One lance at a time makes it so much easier. Um. Wow. 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 <laughs> there goes two mechs pretty quick. No, really nice. Standing by. Copy that. I think I'm gonna hit him with EMP, I guess. Oh jeez. Ah, oh, jeez, now they have turrets, too. So yeah, this is kind of what I expect from the entire playthrough that I'm about to start. Everything Moving seems like it's completely under control until oh, it just they're, isn't they're anymore. They're shooting me and I'm really scared. For real this time. You're asking a lot of an old guy. Railgun turret. Oh dear. 750 L. Oh dear. Arrow turret. And the thumper turret. Okay, um. Well then. That, that needs to go. Yeah, this is, uh, potentially the last episode. <laughs> we'll still have enough to drop on a couple more missions after this, even if we did lose both, uh, Pistol and, uh, Glam. And there goes the TARDIS on the ground. And overheating. Uh-huh. Well, things went south very... Very quickly. And we don't have the ammo to really for keep this up. Okay, so here's the Seth bomber that we've hit. So if we hit him from the left, we should be fine. Okay, so he's gonna go down. Most likely. Yeah, okay. Kill. Okay. I've got multiple weapons with no ammo. So we are down to almost just our Atlas and our Emperor. And our Atlas is I've been sent to out of hyper assault gauss ammo. Damage? Okay Fire. then. I should start using vigilance. I should have been using vigilance already. If that railgun hits, we are in trouble. Good to go. TARDIS standing up. 
I am back up. Do this. Acknowledged. Taking a step. Yeah. I've got to. On it. And not enough. Did shut down. Shutting down. But that railgun, if I don't destroy it before it hits, I lose a mech. Pretty damn hot. Ow, okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Whoa! Easy on the armor, buddy. Okay, I'm going to reserve with Clist and ow. All right, see if we can get the kill on the railgun turret with Grandpa. Ah, oh, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Running him up, knocking him down, just like Mellow Woods. Yes. Okay. So Clist is going to focus on that stealth bomber. Good to go. Like so. And I'm out of armor piercing. Oh dear. That's not good. I am out of armor piercing shots. So maybe rather than replacing armor piercing rounds with standard ammo, maybe I should just add a bin of standard ammo. Assuming it doesn't explode this. Oof. Okay, there goes the TARDIS's head. It's fine. Everything's fine. So, we've lost three mechs. Can we still complete the mission? I'm taking a pounding, Commander! So yeah, even with just one support lance, this is still going to be a challenge playing. Oof. All right. There goes half of uh, half of that mech. Moving to position. That's a miss. Okay. All out of long range. Ah, God, I was sleeping. What do you and want? And I can't punch flying units. You're asking a lot of an old guy. No more missiles. Oh no, I guess I gotta use the bees. Ow. Okay. Oh god, they're, they're shooting me and I'm. I really think scared. we might actually lose this For one. Real this time. I think we might actually lose hey, this we're one. Getting Yikes, that hit it was looking really good there for a minute. I mean, literally all I have left is a Gauss rifle. Why is it not letting me kick him from that side? That's weird. Whatever. On my way. Ah, oh, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Oh yeah, I should be using vigilance. Yeah, that's something that's definitely going to be uh, noteworthy with the new playthrough, is I'm going to have to play well. I'm not going to be able to be lazy. If I, uh, if I neglect to use stuff like Vigilance, then I'm going to just get wrecked. Right leg destroyed. Okay. <laughs> this is so bad.
But it's fine. It's fine. Whoa! Easy on the armor, buddy! Honestly, I'm curious why our arrow four turret helpers aren't really shooting at all. For real this time. Ah, oh, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Oh, and I'm out of LRM ammo. A lot of an old guy. You think I'm stuck in melee with you? No, you're stuck in melee with me. I broke him like my hip. Yeah, I don't I don't think we're gonna be able to pull this one off. Uh, I'm bleeding. Hey, I lost a weapon. Armor's holding. Hmm. Now the real question here, honestly, is would I have even been able to do this if there wasn't a support lance? Because these guys came in and one shot half my lance. Okay. Then there's the turrets we have to deal with. Oh God. Can Grandpa pull it off? Son of a bitch. Ah, God, I was sleeping. Okay, I'm actually going want? to. Wait to use Grandpa until I can see what Clist is able to do. Good to go. Not much. Right, Commander. Oh no, my mech is limping. Oh no. Well, can I have their stuff? And there goes Clist. Ah, oh, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Yeah, sure. You're asking a lot of an old guy. You think I'm stuck in Man, it'd be really nice if I had no, hyper assault ammo. With me. Sleeping. What do you want? Ah, he put his back into a corner. Tricky. Alright. Well, then let's shoot the other one. Boom. Okay. Half a Warhawk down. My hip. They're shooting me and I'm really scared. For real this time. So I think the play here is if I can kill if I can kill the one guy hitting him in the back. Ah oh god, I was sleeping. What do you want? Which can't melee him apparently. You're asking a lot of an old So if guy. I can kill him hitting him in the back. You gotta hit him in the back just like one of them tigers. Okay, things. so he's down. Wow, he fell down like I do. And then this Warhawk is half down already. He has a narc goss rifle and a laser, it looked like.
And then I have an arrow turret. And I have a thumper turret. Oh, God, I was sleeping. So what if do you want? I... Get too far like away from both of them, they'll be able to shoot me. Running them up, knocking them down just like Mellow Woods. But if I can destroy one of the turrets and stand next to the other one, I should be able to finish them off easily enough. I just need to get this dude and his Goss rifle out of here. Ow. Okay, I got too far from the Thumper turret. Yeah. Oh god, uh, they're shooting yep. me and I'm really scared. For real this time. I mean, I want to stay in his side. You're asking of an old guy. Lining him up, knocking him down just like Bella Woods. With the hopes of eventually taking him down. I'm just curious at what point his, uh, our allied turrets are going to start shooting him. Oh god, they hit me. Son of a bitch. Because they aren't for some reason. Ah, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? You're asking a lot of an old guy. Lining him up, knocking him down just like Bella Woods. Okay. Almost there. Ah, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Ah, oh, jeez. <laughs> All right. Oh, I Get close don't to the thumper turret. Fast. It's scary. Vigilance. Shoot the arrow turret. Him up, I couldn't get into his side, like so... Woods. Might as well start getting work done some other way. But he seems to be out of Goss ammo. Ow. Yeah, that arrow does so much oh, damage God, just every me. turn. My pills everywhere. Ah. Yeah, he's down to just a tag, I believe. Ah, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Which means I can literally just ignore him. And You're focus asking the a lot of an old guy. Lining him up, knocking him down just like Bella Woods. Yes. Oh god. Ow. Why does no, 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 no. So Bad. Ah, oh, god, I was sleeping. What do you want? Okay, I'm going to turn enhanced imaging off in part because it has a fail chance and in part because I don't need Grandpa taking injuries from having his armor guy. opened. That's bad. Him up, knocking him down just like Bella Woods. Maybe our maybe our allied turrets will take him out now. Now that he walked into sight. Okay. Oh god, they're, they're shooting me, and I'm really scared. For real this time. Alright. There's that mech down. Okay. All we have left is two turrets. You're asking a lot of an old guy. Just gotta destroy this one. So close. I broke him like my right. hemp. So it gets one more shot on me. Ow. AMS ammo double destroyed. That's fine. That's fine. Ah, oh, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Okay. 
should be in the bag now. Wow. That, uh... That could have gone better. Oh, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? You... Ah, oh, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? You... Oh, this went south very quickly. Ah, oh, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? I wonder what our repair bill is going to be, like, a million, a million and a half, like my hip. more. Don't know. Don't know. Why did we die? I wonder, oh, God, wonder what I mechs we still have and want? which ones we just completely lost. I broke him like my hip. Ah, oh, God, I was sleeping. What do you want? Boom. Okay, finally done. What you get oh jeez, how bad is it going to be? <laughs> how bad is it going to be? Mission successful. Alright, so we got 623,000 sea bills. Nobody died. Somehow, nobody died. Oh, that's right. The, they punched out. So, lost pirate fire control system. Which is honestly just a worse fire control mark, too. Okay. Um, tracker sensors, we have eight. Small advanced cockpit, we do not. So we're going to have to rebuild the TARDIS a little bit. Oof. 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 Yeah. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. And then Glitter Dust, the Hephaestos actually got its engine crit out. Lost an arm, but other than that, the engine crit dropped it. Okay. So. What do we take? I mean... I mean... I know I said I wasn't gonna build anymore, but... That thing... Yeah. Anger Boda, I believe, has Clan Rack 5s. I like Clan Rack 5s. I mean, we could also get some Clan ER Larges. They're good. 55 damage, great range. Uh, we could go for some more Hyper Assault Gauss Rifles. Clan Rack 5s, but... I'm suspicious. I think we lost a mech or two. I think we might have lost a mech or two. I, I think we might have lost... Any case, uh, we'll see what we get out of the Mad Cat Mark II, and... I'm really thinking we lost a mech here. Oh, Clan Feral Lamellar is good, too. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? Let's do that. Let's just let's just do it. Do it. Get what we get. Buy LRM twenty. Clan Narc Launcher. Battle Computer Clustering. Cl uh, Case two Clan. 
Excel engine. Fire control improved, sure, whatever. Uh, Alright, and let's see how bad things are. Alright, so this is exactly why I'm going to be playing my next campaign on very easy mode whenever it comes to the financial stuff, because uh, if this happened every mission, the mission, the, the campaign would end in a week at most. So that's almost 2 million sea bills and 127 days for the repairs. Now, we did not lose anyone, any of the mechs. However, um, yeah. <laughs> That's not doable. That's... 51 days on motor scooter. 38 days on cataclysm. Okay, so... How do we do this? How do we do this? Okay, um... You know what? Let's just stop everything. Let's just stop everything. Alright. Starting with the catapult, because I think that's the easiest fix. Okay, repair. So now I need to drop in. Um. Here's an idea. What if we drop the light peeps and we add a, an AMS and ammo? that. What's going on? One or more components installed in an invalid location. Valid? Oh, because we have a battle computer without a fire control system. So let's fix that. Uh, you don't need a Mark II. Okay. Okay. And then sensors missile range, sure. Why not? Cockpit clan. Sure. Get some armor on here. We actually have more tonnage available, but no more slots. Huh, what do we do then? We could upgrade the ECM to a Guardian ECM.
We really don't need the exchanger. So we'll drop the exchanger in favor of an IFF jammer. Yeah, we'll replace the ECM with a Guardian ECM. That's how we'll... That's how we'll handle that. And then bump a little bit of back armor. There we go. 21 days, 189,000. Okay. The Vulture. Oof. All right, what did we lose? Blech. Wait. I completely forgot. I built the vulture with the shield side, and I just happened to lose the shield side. That's amazing. <laughs> so all we need is a prototype heatsink kit. Which we have right here. And then armor up. And I forget exactly what our armor was at. But you can see just the armor, replacing the armor alone is so expensive late game. Yeah, I would really love to put this build on a Timberwolf instead, just so it had a Clan XL engine. Actually, on that on that note, if we can save one ton, if we could save one ton, we can actually bring more armor. So let's check our energy weapons and see if we have a Clan Large Improved Heavy. There's no way we'd have the heat for it. So. Then again, it's only four tons instead of seven. That would be a heat delta of six. What else do we have that we can play with here? another ton, so that is 36 heat instead of 24. 24. But that lets us put another proto in. And again, the biggest benefit is more armor. So now we have a heat delta of 5. We do lose a little bit of range from the Bombast laser not being able to shoot at the same range as the large laser blaze fire anymore, but we're upgrading the large laser standard into a large laser blaze fire, so we'll still have the two extremely long range weapons, the 840 meters. Our 600 meter shot will now do 80 damage instead of, what was it, 45, 55? Yeah, this is an improvement. And can we go even further? That's too heavy. I'm on my way. 
Yeah, I think that's good. I think that's an improvement. Alright. Next. Or are we already broke? <laughs> Keep in mind, we already scrapped everything. Like, we have no more parts to scrap. Oh, although we do have that Mad Cat Mark II to build to see what we can get out of it. Oh, hey, it's a 95 ton Mad Cat Mark II. Interesting. And it is busted. Super busted. Wow. Seriously? Alright. Alright, so we got a clan exchanger, a clan fire control advanced targeting computer, and a clan heatsink kit for four picks. Not worth not worth at all. But that's fine. 487,000, okay. Hephaestos, I believe, should not need much work, if I remember correctly. I believe this was a pretty quick fix, because it's also Omni. Um. So it mostly needs a clan heat sink kit, which we have three of. Uh, engine heat sink plus one. Engine heat sink plus one. Large pulse laser thunderbolts. Are we gonna drop the streaks? I mean, this this mech has been falling behind a little bit. So do we do we drop the streaks now? Upgrade to something else. So that's effectively what we lost. We lost streaks. Or do we just use clan streaks? So instead of 4, 8, 10, we now have 12 and a bunch of times left over. Bunch of tonnage left over. I really wish I understood why I did this. You know what we can use that extra tonnage for? An AMS Mark II. So that's a hundred shots. Eight hits. AMS caseless. Needs one more slot. Hmm. Oh, case two in the center torso. That's why I have the streak ammo there. Huh. So what would I drop? Oh. I could drop some cooling. I could drop some cooling. Be running a little bit hotter than it was, but something like that. And then drop a little bit of armor. Drop a little bit of armor and so 
something like that. And then drop in another bin. Ah. Drop in another bin of AMS ammo. So that should be plenty of ammo to keep the AMS going. Or I could drop the heat sink back in to make sure it stays cool. I don't know. Right. I'll we'll give it a shot throwing AMS in everyone. Cataclysm. Mm. Mm hmm. Oof. Oh no. We just lost all of our armor piercing Goss ammo. We just lost all of our armor piercing Goss ammo. Yeah, we don't we don't have any more. Well then, it's fine. It it's it's fine. We can't afford to repair everything anyway. So the emperor, the emperor, we will hold off on. Although Clist has super cool lasers, really. So maybe we turn it into a laser boat. Oh, and it lost stealth armor? Yeah. And lost its stealth armor. Well then. Okay. So the Atlas here, you'd think this wouldn't be too bad of a repair. Ammo, AMS, double bin. Actually, I think instead of a double, we'll go one regular and one caseless. All right. Okay. And then we need ammo for the Hyper Assault 40. We need a lot of ammo for the Hyper Assault 40. So I think I'm going to drop the Streak 20. Hyper Goss double. So that is 30, 42. So that's just, just over 10 shots. So that's plenty. Hold on a second. Oh, hold on, hold on a second. Can I, can I actually? Let me just let me just drop all of this real quick and let me see. I could. I could. I very well could. Slots would be a small problem. And I think that means I wouldn't be able to put a uh, LRM. So even... Yeah, because those slots... The slots from the Hyper Assault 40 on the arm have to go into the side torso. Eh. Yeah. Oh 
would I be able to put any kind of missile or uh, what am I doing? But uh, that's a 15. Uh, 10. 10 is still 2. Okay. I could put an LRM 5. Or I could drop the AMS. You know what? What's what's just the armor gonna cost? So, just getting the armor back is so expensive. Yeah, it's almost half a million just for the armor. Okay. It's so long. Like, yeah. This this is exactly why I'm going to be turning down the armor repair time and armor repair costs substantially for my next playthrough. But, while we're here... think because even if I drop the AMS mark 2 uh, I do have a clan LR 20 which can go there because the streak cannot right yeah the streak cannot Clan LRM-20 can. So then we move the Clan LRM-15 to the other side. Oh no, that's right, the streak was really good because we don't have Artemis. Um... It's a real shame that I can't put the streak 20 and the hyper assault goss in the same so what I can do is that. So then the streak 20 has plus 2 accuracy from where it was. The hyper assault goss has minus 1 accuracy. However, pretty sure, yes, I have a weapon mount heat here. Boom. So now the goss rifle hyper assault 40 has plus 2 accuracy. The streak LRM 20 has plus 2 accuracy. And we can put in another, say... Rack 5. Do I have a clan UAC 5 floating around somewhere? Hmm. So ideally, I'd like to keep both the AMSs. I mean, Clan LB5 is 45 damage, but it's 6 tons. Yeah, that's, that's actually considerably better. UAC2. I'll take it. I don't have ammo for it. How unfortunate. How absolutely unfortunate.
What are we going to do? So we have six tons to play with. We want to add more AMS ammo. Although actually we want the caseless to be better protected, so something like that. There's no way we have room for the UAC-5, yeah. We don't have slots, we don't have tonnage, but the UAC-2 we do have the slots for, just not the tonnage. I mean, alternatively... I can just do this, and be able to punch and only lose the two medium lasers when I punch. What about what about short range or medium range missiles, MRMs? I mean heavy MRM ten. Not much longer range than an SRM. I think I'd rather have streak SRMs than a heavy MRMs. But, let's just look for the sake of argument. All we have is Swarm, yeah. I would absolutely take some streak, uh, like Street 6 right here. Streak SRM-6. Hmm. <sighs> oh, I still need the ammo for the streak launcher. Curiosity, can I put clan, uh, the clan case 2 in the arm? Yes, I can. Alright. better yet. The hyper assault ammo is inert. So do something like that. And that leaves me with one slot and 2.5 tons. Tons. 
one slot and 2.5 tons. Hmm. <laughs> what do I do with one slot and 2.5 tons? I don't know. I really don't know. But the, the LRM-15 with one and a half bins of ammo runs out really fast and is not very substantial when it comes to how much it's actually contributing. Hmm. I just realized we're running a standard engine in this thing. We are running a standard engine. Ah, the side torso, not enough slots. Ah. Yeah, that would take up, <laughs> that would take up all the slots. So no, I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna leave it and not not worry about that at all. Um I could drop composite in. Save myself some slots and Nah. Nah. So maybe another medium X pulse. Actually, I can drop the turret mount too. I mean, at this point, it would only be benefiting the Hyper Assault 40. And again, I think I'd rather put the Hyper Assault 40 on the arm. And use the weapon mount heat. Ah, but then he can't punch and also shoot it. I don't know, actually. I mean, I have a turret mount sitting around, so... I mean, I have half a ton and no slots. Half a ton, no slots. So right now the heat efficiency is going to be 112.87. So... 35 heat delta versus a 25 heat delta. There we go. So the exchanger double plus is a massive upgrade over the clan exchanger. And we can literally just not shoot the X pulses if we don't uh, if we don't have the heat for it. So, what do we do with half a ton? Our armor is essentially maxed. Is there anything I can do with half a ton? I 
No? I don't think so. So, I guess we'll just, uh... Armor up every little bit we can. And... There we go. So we have... It actually does slightly less Alpha Strike damage. Now that we're dropping the other M15. But... It's fine. It's fine. We'll, we'll see how it plays. Assuming we can survive the 55 days of refit time. Alright. So we have 1.7 million. And 55 days on Grandpa's ride. See, this, this is why... This is why the challenge run is going to be challenge run only for the missions. The the rest of it's going to be not so much challenge. Um I mean Got some Warhammer 2C parts we can throw in the blender. Marauder 2C parts we can throw in the blender. And we still need a little bit more, so I'm gonna I'm gonna spend a little bit of time between episodes just selling a bunch of stuff from the store. Basically, I'm gonna go through and sell everything that I have a bunch of, or Inner Spear Tech, or whatever. Clan Streak Six. Eh, we'll figure it out. Um. But yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna do that after the, after I'm done recording here. So for uh, for now, this has been your episode of Rogue Tech for the day. I hope you enjoyed it, and until next time, have a good one.